Star Wars is no stranger to criticism from the scientific community, with perhaps the biggest source of criticism being directed toward the apparent misuse of the term parsecs in Han Solo's boast about the Millennium Falcon's ability to take the Kessel Run faster than most ships. The argument is that, in reality, a parsec is a unit of distance, and Han Solo seems to be using it as a unit of time, when, in fact, he really means both. To understand this use of parsecs, we must first understand what the Kessel Run is. The Kessel Run is a dangerous hyperspace route that is 18 parsecs in length and is used by smuggler and bounty hunter types to transport spice from Kessel to buyers in hut space and all over the rest of the galaxy. The dangers of the route came from its close proximity to the Ma Nebula of large black holes. This required pilots to enter and exit hyperspace more often than is typically required of other hyperspace routes, since ships can't travel in straight lines for very long in hyperspace due to the danger of other celestial objects in the way, such as those black holes. But Han Solo was able to pilot the Millennium Falcon dangerously close to these black holes by limiting his jumps in and out of hyperspace, cutting huge distances and time off the traditional route and made the Kessel Run in less than 12 parsecs, staying true to the real-world definition of a parsec as a unit of distance. The specifics of the Kessel Run fall under legends and are no longer canon. But it can be assumed that Han Solo's record still involved beating the competition by cutting corners and shortening the route significantly, or else he wouldn't have anything to brag about in A New Hope or The Force Awakens. I hope this all comes in handy when you're looking to win an argument against a Star Wars cynic sometime in the future. Until next time, this has been another entry into our Star Wars Dictionary. If you're interested, you can check out more Star Wars and related things in our blog sites, Rational Fanboy and Cool Stuff Collective.